So I, I go to my Rebbe, Rebbe Gamliel, before I go up to, to Maron. So I said this year, I said to him, um, he said to me, listen, whatever you need, whatever you need, take something on, whatever it is, you don't have to tell anybody, take something on, you'll see Yeshua's. Okay. Last year, my daughter, last year, my daughter Hindi was there because it came out once these Shabbos. When it comes out Shabbos, I take my family. Because during the week, I just fly in, I just fly out. So she was there, and she went to Rabbi Gamliel. Gamliel said, you want to be a kala? Go up with your father and be makabal something, and you better keep what you're being makabal. Write it down on a piece of paper, what you're being makabal, and you'll see that next year you'll come back like Boim. He didn't say you're going to be married. He said, next year by like Omer, you will know your chassan. That's what he told me. That's what he told my daughter. Okay? Oh, now I told you what happened to her. Okay. I wasn't going to tell you what happened to her. But anyway, so... So on Lagba Omer, on Lagba Omer, this past Lagba Omer, is when she was macabre to marry the guy that she was going out with, the guy engaged, Baruch Hashem. We had a vort this past Sunday to a very nice boy. And she was freaking out because... On Lag Bomer, he said, you will know your chassan. And on Lag Bomer, she decided this is the right guy. But she didn't say anything to anyone. She didn't say anything. And then, she's with her chassan. She got engaged Sunday night. She's with her chassan. And she says, she tells him, you know, I went to Rebbe Gamliel last year, and I was macabre something, and I was macabre something, and Baruch Hashem, on like Bomer, he said, on like Bomer, you'll know. Not, she said, not a day before, on like Bomer, I knew. So he said, so what were you macabre? So she usually don't tell anybody what you were macabre. She said, okay, they're engaged. She can tell them, right? So I was macabre that five minutes before Shabbos, I'll be ready. And he said to her, what? What did you say? She said, I was macabre that five minutes before Shabbos, I'd be ready. Okay. He says, you're not going to believe this. Last year, I went to Rabbi Gamliel because Yeshiva, Yeshiva went up to, to, to Maron. And when I went to Rabbi Gamliel, he said, if you want to find the Kala, you want to know your Kala by next Lagba Omer, you have to be a Kabbal something. He says, so I wrote down on a piece of paper that from now on, I'll make sure I'm ready for Shabbos five minutes before Shabbos. So they were both a the same thing without knowing who was macabre, that they were macabre the same thing. So it's a very big Indian to be, on my moment, to be macabre something. You've just experienced another Torah class brought to you by TorahAnytime.com.